Hi everyone, my name is Sandra Devana and I'm going to talk about the issue related to cybercrime and cyberbullying that should be introduced to young people. Now I agree with this idea. Sometimes the information that we put out there could actually backlash to us without us realizing. In cybercrime matter, for example, when we want to shop in online websites, sometimes the website require our um, credit or debit card number and other of our information. Now, this actually could lead to an ATM fraud or internet fraud. Another thing called identity theft happens quite a lot of time too. It's when someone stole our identity and use it as if it's theirs. For example, in social media, we tend to put up uh, our birth date, where we live, where we currently study, who we hang out with, and even what we like. This information could be used by the identity thief uh, for their own purposes. So with that, we have to talk the younger kids to uh, be careful on what we put out there in the cyber world. Another thing, uh, cyberbullying um, is actually have, has been happening for a long time and sometimes ended up in a bad way. What we need to talk the uh, younger people is that when we don't have anything nice to say about other people, then we don't say it at all. Basically, we don't spread a head speech. Uh, towards someone or something um, because sometimes our comment uh, that we thought that it was just a silly comment could actually uh, affect the other person's mentality or their feeling so these two things cyberbullying and cybercrime is an important thing to be educated thank you